Hello everyone, I am Shyam Pasari and welcome to ASIN Academy. As you have seen from the title of this video that we will be discussing about Heron's formula in this video. So without wasting any further time, let's find out what it is and how do we solve problems related to it. Now before moving on to the Heron's formula, we have to understand what is a semi-perimeter. Now as you can see, we have taken a triangle with the vertices A, B and C respectively with the length of the side AB as C, the side BC as A and the side CA as B. Now we all know that the perimeter of a triangle is equal to sum of all the sides. Now in this case, our perimeter is A plus B plus C. Now semi-perimeter is nothing but the half of the perimeter. So I can say that the semi-perimeter of a triangle is equal to A plus B plus C by 2. Now let's move on to the Heron's formula. Now Heron's formula is used to find the area of a triangle when all the lengths of the sides are given. Now we know that area of a triangle is equal to half into base into height. But in some cases to find the height of the triangle is always not that easy. So in those cases we use the Heron's formula given that all the lengths of the sides are provided. Formula is equal to under root of S into S minus A into S minus B into S minus C. And remember that everything is under the square root and over here S is the semi-perimeter and A, B and C are the sides of the triangle. So by this formula you can easily calculate the area of any triangle given that you know all the sides of the triangle. Taking an example, suppose we have this triangle having the sides as 3, 4 and 5 units respectively and according to our question we have to find the area of this triangle. So firstly we have to find the semi-perimeter of this triangle. So S is equal to 3 plus 4 plus 5 whole divided by 2 which is equal to 6 units. Now we know the semi-perimeter so we can easily put it in the formula. So upon putting the values we will get 6 into 6 minus 3 which is equal to 3, 6 minus 4 which is equal to 2 and 6 minus 5 which is equal to 1. So upon multiplying you will finally get the value as under root of 36 which is equal to 6 units. So the area of our given triangle is equal to 6 units. So this is how you calculate the area by using the Heron's formula of any given triangle given that the lengths of all the three sides are provided. That was all for this video and I hope that you understood all the topics covered in this video. And if you have any doubt then you can post your doubts down in the comment section or you can send your doubts to us to our channel's official Instagram or Facebook page and we will surely solve your doubt as soon as possible. Or you can go to the official website of ASIN Academy and you can send your doubts to us from there and all the links are provided down in the description. And if you did like the video, then please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel ASIN Academy.